Like most toddlers, 10-month-old Connor Rice loves his swing, but recently Connor was in no mood for even a gingerly push from his mom when he spiked a troubling fever. He woke up at about 1 o'clock in the morning with 105 degree fever, and I tried um, Motrin and the cold bath, and nothing seemed to brought, bring it down. And this is after two days of an antibiotic for a throat infection. Noticing little change in Connor's condition, Trish Rice rushed him to the hospital. They gave him a larger dose of Motrin and um, a dose of Tylenol orally. They took a chest x-ray. They um, took some blood for blood tests. They gave him an IV to hydrate him. After several hours in the emergency room, the Rices were advised to continue Connor's follow-up care later that day with their family physician, Dr. Shane Peng. All right, let's see. By the time the Rices arrived at Dr. Peng's office, he already had a timely, high-tech read on the toddler's medical status. When he came back, he said, I was able to look at the records on the computer from the hospital. And I said, already? We were just there. We just left. And he said, I know. It's, it's an amazing thing. Amazing, all right. Revolutionary is what many medical professionals like to call it. It is PACS, or Picture Archiving and Communication System a filmless digital imaging and delivery system that allows all Sentara hospitals and referring physicians, specialists, clinicians, and imaging centers to quickly access patients' medical records. With a touch of a few buttons, everything from x-rays to high-tech computerized scans can travel from workstation to workstation, from one office to another, and even to remote locations using a web-based browser. Having been able to access the, the exact films, I was able to kind of determine that he did have some abnormality in his chest x-ray, and we were able to continue with uh, the treatment, and, um, and I think that had allowed Connor to get better sooner. Quite a change from past practices. What the radiologist would have read the report, that would have had to be transcribed, and then the hard piece of paper would have come to me by inter-office mail or otherwise, and that could be days. The heart size is within normal limits, period. Radiologist Dr. Ravi Shamangar of Sentara's Careplex Hospital in Hampton says while state-of-the-art technology is designed with enhanced patient care in mind, it's also an important time-saving and quality care tool for radiologists. Each radiologist is able to do much more in, in a day. We can you know, zoom in on the picture and look at things a little bit better, and um, the quality of the images is actually better than it used to be. The nice thing is, if we see something that we want to let another doctor know about, we can you know, make sure that we point it out to the doctor. And when we sign off on the report, that little arrow will remain there. And we can even annotate and put little messages for the clinician so that they know what we're talking about. Images can be distributed to multiple departments and multiple users at the same time. And PAX also includes image storage on short and long-term archives for comparison purposes. Voice dictation capabilities, like the one used by Dr. Shemangar, are also being integrated into PAX. A voice recognition system, it allows for instantaneous um, transcription as we dictate. Sentara's commitment to cutting-edge technology means both patients and doctors will continue to benefit from this rapidly evolving system. We all win here. Um, it's all about uh, getting the results back to us quickly so we can affect possibly change in patient care. This is Venturi reporting.